Oh, 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 it's a big one. Holy cow. What's going on everybody? Nick from 618 Fishing here. And today I'm setting a pretty high goal. And that goal is to catch a new personal bass. To complete this goal, I'm heading to a fishing spot where I've been hooking into some massive, massive crock. But the big ones always seem to come off the end of my line. I'm hoping that changes today. I've been walking through the woods for quite some time, but I'm coming up to the spot and it is in some pretty dense woods. So it's, uh, it's a little tricky to get to, but once I'm there, there are some big fish back there. All right, guys, I finally made it. This lay down right here behind me, I hooked into three fish that were over one pound within 30 minutes of fishing. One of those fish, I'm pretty sure, was my new personal best. That one, unfortunately, broke off. So I'm back here today for a little redemption. All right, to get this done, I have a handful of baits that I could choose from, but there's one bait in particular that I just recently found on the internet that I was very impressed by. So I'm gonna start off with that. I've got this little Mayfly soft plastic on the smallest jig head that I own. If this does not work out, I may change over to just a plain hook, but I'm gonna start with this. All right, first cast. Oh, first cast guys, no way. <laughs> well, I guess it works. First cast and I caught a decent little crappie. I'm after something just a little bit bigger than this though. See you later, buddy. I am uh, feeling a whole lot better about this bait. I thought it looked very strange. Sorry about the wind. I thought it looked very strange in the package, but apparently the crappie like it. Fish on. Oh, it's a nice one. Holy cow, hit it just as I'm about to pull out of the water. Easy, buddy. This is the size I'm talking about. All right, landing these fish is a little tricky. Got to jump down here. Yes! <laughs> now this is a nice crappie. All right, I'm going to quickly get a weight on this guy. I don't think this is going to be a new personal best, but he was digging this little mayfly. 1.08. See you later, buddy. Awesome, awesome fish. Coming in at 1.1 pounds, that last fish it's not quite my PB. My personal best crappie is 1.34. So it is very close. It's on the doorstep and I know there are some big ones out here. So the search continues. Fish on. All right. This bait goes from catching small crappie to a giant crappie back to a small crappie. So very versatile, very versatile bait so far. See you later, buddy. Fish on. Oh, it's a nice one. There we go. All right, not quite as big as that, that last big one. Still a very nice crappie though. Points, 0.59, so a little over half a pound. I'm looking for a fish about three times this guy's size, which is mind blowing to me because I think this is a really nice crappie. See you later, buddy. All right, here's the deal, guys. This bait that I'm using is performing awesome. I've caught one fish, almost a personal best, not quite, but still a really nice crappie, and I've caught a few others. And I've been fishing this same brush pile the entire time, so, I'm gonna try to catch a personal best right here, but if this does not work out, I'm gonna switch over to some similar looking spots that I've never fished. I can actually see them on the other side of the lake, this little cove, and try those spots out. So far though, this day is going pretty dang good. Oh, there we go. Oh, it's a nice one. Holy cow. 
This is a big one. This is a big one. Yes! Holy smokes! This might... This seems bigger than that first one pounder. Oh my gosh. Whew. All right, I'm gonna get a weight on him, but holy cow. 1.19. <sighs> Not a PB, still a massive crappie though. Biggest one of the day. What a beautiful fish. See you later, buddy. My technique is very simple. You guys saw the lure I'm using. I have that on a 132nd ounce jig head, then a strike indicator about 24, 30 inches above there. My retrieve is also very simple, casting into the wind. This wind is dragging my bait right across the front of this brush pile. Then I'm just giving it some twitches to give it a little extra action. See you later, buddy. I've caught a handful of fish in this first spot that I came to, but the fishing has slowed down a little bit. So I think what I'm going to do is adventure around to some of these similar locations, try to find the same type of brush environment and see if there's a big one lurking there. All right guys, this is the first spot I've come to on this side of the cove. I've actually already fished here, but I forgot to press record on the GoPro. So um, I guess I'll catch one more fish for you guys on camera because I'm an idiot. Watch me catch a 10 pounder now. That would be freaking sweet. There we go. All right. So yeah, I've caught about, I don't know, five copy at this location, they've all been about this size, so nothing too, nothing too big. See you later, buddy. So I'm gonna go ahead and find a different spot. The, uh, the lay down I'm gonna fish is down here. I don't know if I can actually get to it though. I guess we'll find out. Oh, look, somebody built a bridge. Dare I cross it? Guess we'll try. All right, I'm gonna try to cross this uh, this man-made bridge. I'm a little nervous, to be honest. And the turtles are freaking out. Oh, well, that's a big turtle, holy cow. All right, well, I made it. Unfortunately, my uh, camera is Still over there, so I'm gonna have to go get that. All right, now to cross the bridge with a three thousand dollar camera. Oh, that was sketchy. Okay, I made it. Hopefully, this spot's worth it. Well, that was uh, that was a little bit too sketchy for my liking, but I've made it to this little laydown. It's more like an island. It's a giant laydown. Hopefully, it was worth it though. All right, guys. Unfortunately, I'm not having any luck here. The risk was definitely not worth the reward because I have not caught a single fish. I'm gonna go ahead and uh, see if I can find any other spots. Well, I've been fishing for a couple hours, working my way along this bank, but I could just not seem to locate the crappie so they may not be over on this side so I'm actually going to double back and head back to that first area that I was fishing because I was having the most luck back there that uh that expedition didn't it did not pay off I caught I think five fish all pretty small so I am back here four hours later and I'm hoping that some uh big crappie have moved into this brush pile if not I'm just gonna explore this little bank right here to hopefully find that new PB. I haven't really tried this side of the lay down. There we go. 
All right. Whew, not a big one, but it's been a while since my last fish, so this certainly feels good. Oh, <laughs> see you later, buddy. Fish on. Cast after cast. All right. I love catching you guys, but where is your big brother? I've got to say though, I am a, oh, there's a fish. <laughs> I was about to say, uh, I'm impressed with this bait. All right, I moved a little bit. I am uh, fishing a different brush pile. Looks very promising though. Oh, 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 it's a big one. Oh my gosh. You guys, this is a big one. Holy cow. It's off. No. No, no, no. Dang it. That was a big one. I've been fishing for uh, quite some time. It's getting late. Unfortunately, I have not caught my PB today, but I came close a couple times and I could have very well had it on earlier and then he came off. So fishing's definitely been good. Just have not broken that PB that I was hoping to today. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, that's a nice one. Yes. That's a big crappie. Holy smokes. This could be a new PB. Oh, okay. I'm like shaking right now. 1.34, no way. That ties my old PB. All right, I'm gonna wait one more time. <laughs> That's crazy. Just tied my PB, I will take it. Holy cow. See you later, buddy. Oh, there's a fish. Oh, this is a nice one. <sighs> one point one four. So this is my I think the second biggest of the day. See you later, buddy. What a day of fishing, guys. I didn't exactly complete my goal of breaking my personal best, but I tied it, so I will take that. As far as these soft plastics I was using today, I would highly recommend them. They're a little expensive, but they hold up very well. I only lost one soft plastic and that's because I got it snagged. I will leave the link in the description if you guys are interested. I had a lot of fun today. I hope you guys have enjoyed watching. I will catch you in the next right. one. I don't know if someone was camping out here, but there's like a little makeshift <laughs> shelter, I guess. I don't know. All right, got me a, another shelter. Very good. This one's a little bit, a little bit bigger. Anyways, um, <laughs> check it out, guys. Just found a morel mushroom. That's pretty cool. I don't see any other ones though.